Yo, what's up guys? Um, before I was talking about Josh also, it's because I've been crying. Like, I'm crying like a baby. I don't know why I'm crying, bro. Like, I don't know why I'm crying. I don't know why I'm crying. I don't know why I'm crying. It's easy control. I'm checking. Baka ni kwa job mzee na patatu machuzi tunatoka tu for no reason. So what's up guys? Uh, welcome to my YouTube channel. In case you're new here, my name is Fancy and today I'm back with another video. So I I don't know if I should be shooting this video right now, but I just feel like I need to talk to you guys because. You're my family, you know. You guys have been supporting me for the longest time. You guys have been there, you know. But then when you pick up push, any so um, but then you go and give it to me. We talked last week. I've been telling my friends, man, say it's a dream that I feel. I feel royal we go heavy. I need to like to 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 let out some things from my chest, bro. Any, na fu ni makuwa tu ni kigulia ya. The whole of last week, machozi tu na toka ni kwa job na si na try ku control wapi na toka. If you ask me what is wrong, si ziko ambia. Yani ni kwa tu hapo. Yani ina toka mbaka ina fuka to a point where. I feel like I miss home. I miss my dad. Sana sana nisikani kama ni me miss baba. You know my dad is that person. Like when I'm going through something, I always call my dad. Like he is the first person I always think of. Like I just want to talk to him. You know. Now all the time when I talk to him, I always feel good. Like I'm happy. I'm excited. The energy is. Back. Oh my God. Shit. Any. Nazi ni kama ni babango ni feeli ni feeli. Any. Any ni mini ni lipenda budango tangu ni kwa mles. Like akuna kutunge ni show. No no. As in akuna kutunge akuna mtunge ni show kitu. Na mtunge ni show kitu mbaya kusu budango ni tunge kwa sana. Hata saa hii nge nisho kitu. Ok, saa hii ni kwa mbigi hivyo, unajua na elewa vitu njuna kuru. Unaona, kitu enye, manzee suji mbona mbona na feel bile na feel. Kutoka last week, beginning of last week. Actually, since we traveled, suji ni bile niko peke yangu, I'm scared, niko na anxiety. I don't know how to like express myself or tell someone something, like when they're doing something and I'm not feeling it. I, I don't know how to tell them to like stop and it kind of like eating me up. I'm gonna miss home. Sijui na sikia tu na miss Bobangu kutoka last week. I've been trying to reach him. He has been mtenja. Amekua mtenja. Ikanibu, yani ikanibu. Because I feel like that is the only person I'm gonna ponga like. Free na ye, ya neza tumombea. Anything I can joke with him like. Neza mshu kitu ya watu na pia neza kitu. Neza mshu tu anything. No, no. Like manze. I feel too vibe. Miss Jiko ni. Nasikia na miss home. Nasikia na penda. Na miss watu enye na penda manze. Nasikia na miss company ya kina Jude. Na manzi ya kina Kemunto. I feel too. I feel too vibe. Yani. Okay, I know like I feel like I should be home and not here. I feel like I should be I don't know. I feel but I can't be home because I need money, I need to work. You know like I feel I've never in my life like felt I've never got to a point Where I feel like I really need to be with my family. Like, okay, ni me chronic sema. I would want to be with my family and my friends and the people that I love, but it has never gotten me to a point where I'm crying and 
as much as I'm trying to convince myself it's okay. As in, you keep to my zipper door in and eat up. Because when oh, you travel, like it's not like the first time I traveled to Qatar. When I went to Qatar, of course, yes, I was missing my family and stuff, but it's not the same as I am feeling today. I, I feel like I don't want to be away from my dad. I don't know why, but I feel like my dad has been the best person to me. Like, Every time we talk, you know, every time we joke, and as in he's a good guy, you know, and I feel like I don't want to be far from him. He's my luck. I always call him my luck because he's the best guy, you know, always encouraging, always like, um, you know, being there for you as much as he's not there for you financially. Yani maze, atakwambia tu kitu na kufiti. Yani, I don't want this feeling. Si itagi kabisa, because... I want to be okay. I want to... I don't want to pretend I'm fine. I don't want, because... As much as I'm trying to be strong, I'm not strong enough. I feel like... Something is missing. I feel like I need to break my dad so bad because I don't know. <laughs> oh my god, I can't believe I'm even doing this video. Like, what am I doing? <laughs> but honestly speaking, I feel like I miss home. I miss home, I miss food, I miss the weather. Manze, I'm telling you, it's fucking cold, it's freezing cold. You don't even have anyone to go home to. You just like go work, come back home, sleep, go work, come back home. Like, I feel I miss everything at home. I miss, I miss, I miss being with the people that I love especially my dad i don't know why i'm having this feeling and it kind of scaring me because when i was in kenya we didn't have like that much time together we just kind of spent like a few we kind of met once you know and we had amazing time with my dad we were dancing we were just taking videos he was telling me how he went to he want to be creating content and stuff like he just loves music he loved to buy the music as in i feel i feel like i had time to be with him and now I, I took it for granted. I feel like I took that for granted. Like I had like a whole year and I, we, I didn't make an effort of spending time with him more often. Like I don't, I don't know bro, like I feel, I feel sad and I feel like I kind of let myself down sometimes because I could have just, I could have just like followed my heart and maybe right now I would just like be more happier than being sad, being away from him. And not get into like spending time with him, you know. Last week it was crazy. I was like, I just want to talk to him. I have to talk to him. I have to talk to him. And I have to talk to him. I haven't talked to him. I was supposed to talk to him today. But I did not talk to him. I've been trying to call him. And if 
for is not going through. I don't know. I just feel like if I talk to my dad, whatever I'm feeling inside. I don't know, it's, it's going to go away. Like, I feel so bad right now. I don't even know what to do. I don't. I, I, Tell me what you think I should do. <laughs> You've been my family, you know. I feel like I should have, like, we could have just, like, spent a lot. Like, we, we could have done a lot. We could have, have had that. What? What? You are the sick as I feel it to me a lot. Sometimes being the first boy is kind of exhausting. I know, I know, I know, I know, but it's kind of exhausting. Holy shit. You always feel like the world is on your shoulders, man. <laughs> I don't know what to do, but um, I'll try my best. I'm going to try my best. I'm going to keep going. I wish you guys you can just like meet my dad. He's he's such a comedian. But anyway, inshallah, I'll keep trying. I'll keep trying. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> I'm so sorry, guys. I felt like I needed to let some things out of my chest. Thank <laughs> you.